I, uh, I apologize for this being last minute, but I do truly appreciate everybody rushing over here to get this. We weren't anticipating this to be released today, so it's as much of a surprise to me as it is to you. We were uh, excited, but uh, anyway, let me move on. It's been four months since we've last provided an update on the investigation into the disappearance of Noel Rodriguez Alvarez. This week marks a year that Noel was last seen alive. Just a couple of hours ago, a Tarrant County grand jury has indicted Cindy Rodriguez Singh on felony charges, including capital murder, two counts of injury to a child, and one count of abandoning without the intent to return. I'm so incredibly thankful to the Tarrant County District Attorney's Office and the DA Investigator's Office for their support and work on this case. These indictments will significantly support our effort to apprehend and extradite Cindy back to the United States. Teams are already working with the U.S. Marshal's Office on that effort. Over the past six months, our investigative teams have worked relentlessly on this case. They have been truly dedicated in the searches for Noel and justice. I could not be more proud of the work that this team has put into this case, and I am incredibly thankful for all of them. Since our last update, investigators have continued to work tirelessly, including additional ground searches and tracking down new leads. It is essential to understand that our goal right now is to seek justice for Noel. And for that reason, I'm only able to share limited information above and beyond what has already been shared. Although this is a tremendous milestone for the justice in this case, make no mistake that our work is not done. We will continue to work towards justice and we will continue to search for Noel. I'm going to turn the podium over real quick to the mayor for the city of Everman, Mayor Ray Richardson, to share a few words with you, and then I'm going to come back and answer any questions that you might have. Mayor? Hello. Uh, first of all, I'd like to personally thank the detectives of the Everman Police Department and all the outside agencies that came to assist us during our time of need. Uh, 2023 has been a difficult year for the city of Everman. Not a day goes by that someone doesn't ask about Noel or the missing little boy from Everman. No child should ever have to go through the abuse and neglect that Noel went through. Now that the murder warrant has been issued, we will hopefully be able to get the answers to many unanswered questions that surround this case. The goal is and always has been to locate Noel and give him the justice that he deserves. Sometimes when bad things happen, good things come out of it. Sometime over the next few weeks, the City of Everman will be dedicating an all-inclusive playground that is designed for children with special needs such as Noel. The playground will be named the Noel Angel Alvarez Playground. This playground will keep Noel's memory alive in the citizens' minds and hearts for many years to come. Obviously, we would prefer that Noel was still here, being a little boy and going to school, but unfortunately the reality is that Noel may never be found. So uh, whether you knew Noel or not, he will be missed and loved by community that could never understand how this could have happened to an innocent child named Noel. 